worried customers queuing up outside banks in China's Hebei province to withdraw money. Barred from withdrawing large cash amounts by the People's Bank of China, the panic was highly visible. Soon the same restrictions will be imposed in Zhejiang province and the city of Shenzhen. China's dream of being an economic powerhouse lies shattered. The precarious health of Chinese banks is gradually coming to light with a steady rise in non-performing assets. The biggest concern is over the Dragon Nation's ambitious Belt and Road Initiative or the BRI. A large chunk of the BRI financing has been done through China's state-owned banks. Now with the repayment issues cropping up in projects like the China-Pakistan Economic Corridor, the stress is finally showing up on the banking sector. The non-performing assets are likely to rise further and touch alarming levels. With its banking sector crumbling, China has now regulated the transaction limits. Cash transactions of 5 lakh yuan or above will be regulated for business accounts. Limits have been set for personal accounts too. The Communist Party of China says that the move is aimed at boosting cash circulation and addressing illegal activities. But everyone knows the reality. The expansionist moves of President Xi Jinping and unleashing the Chinese virus on the world is finally hurting the authoritarian nation. Unfortunately, the Chinese people will pay for their government's follies.